Hi dear students and viewers welcome back to my channel N Vinay Kumar Basics of Physics dear students in this video we are going to discuss about the one of the important short answer question that is derive an expression for the magnetic induction at the center of a circular coil using biot's law by using biot's outs law we have to find out the magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil so before going to start the video children my request is i am uploading the all the videos regarding the intermediate first year secondary physics secondary physics and along with mc previous year questions and syllabus of mc neat i am going to upload that's why you can subscribe my channel and press the bell icon too and inform about my channel to the others okay without let we are going to the topic so look here one second question this is the important four marks question derive an expression for the magnetic induction at the center of a circular coil using biot sort's law so dear students so this is the circular coil and there should be having some radius r radius r smaller is what radius of the circular coil and what you have to derive magnetic induction clear the circular coil is using s by its sort's law here there is some current i is passing through the circular coil so what we know according to oil state principle when there is any current in the conductor or any material due to the passing of current the magnetic field will be developed magnetic induction should be developed clear that's why here now what we know this is the one circular coil that is having radius r in that i amount of current it is there then here according to the right hand thumb rule what you have to find out s when the current is in a circular coil it is like a in the direction of folded fingers then here the thumb indicates the direction of magnetic field direction of magnetic field so here to find out the magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil we have to take the one particular element of length dl particular length of dl so here according to biot's sort's law what we write the magnetic induction of particular element small element is what right db is equals to mu not by 4 pi into i dl sin theta by r square so this is the equation for what magnetic induction what is db magnetic induction of the particular length of d element that is the element that should be having length dl so that is given by the what it is by using the biot sort's law this is what biot sort's law according to the biot sort's law right db is equals to v not by 4 pi into ideal sin theta by r square so what is the here this is the distance or radius that's why here children here for the particular element this is the direction of magnetic field direction of what magnetic field so here what is theta theta is the angle between angle between r and dl r and dl what is the radius vector and dl is the what length of the element so this is the angle between the r and dl when these two are perpendicular to each other these two are perpendicular to each other when r and dl are perpendicular to each other we have to write db is equals to mu not by 4 pi i dl sin 90 degrees by r square so what we know sin 90 is equals to 1 then what we write db is equals to what mu not by 4 pi i dl by r square so this is a magnetic induction of element dl now we want to find out the total magnetic induction total magnetic induction total magnetic induction because of entire length so for that here we have to integrate the above equation we have to 
integrate the above equation for what total magnetic induction for total magnetic induction so what right for total magnetic induction so simply we are doing integration like this integral dv is equals to integral mu naught by 4 pi i d l by r square so dear students in this equation mu naught is constant 4 pi is constant and i is constant constant amount of current is passing through the coil and what is r r is the radius of circle radius of the s here in this equation mu naught is constant 4 pi is constant i is constant and r is also constant so the, the only variable thing is dl only variable thing is dl so that's why here here these two are cancel what you get b is equals to we are writing mu naught by 4 pi into i of i by r square of integral dl integral dl from the water children b is equals to mu naught by 4 pi i by r square s yes. here what you get this is the l total length so here what is total length length is equals to nothing but circumference circumference of circle that is what children l is equals to 2 pi r so here started and when it is come to again same place then what it is used total circumference that is equals to what length of the y that's why we can write b is equals to mu naught by 4 pi of i into r square by that is what 2 pi r 2 pi r here square root r cancel 2 pi is are s to 1 is are 2 <coughs> 2 pi 2 is are and then what you get b is equals to what you get children b is equals to here mu naught i mu naught i by 2 r mu naught i by 2 r that is the expression for magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil why we are saying at the center of the circular coil when the current should be in the circular coil obviously the magnetic induction should be in this direction so that's what you have to say b is equal to mu naught by 2 r if the coil consists of n number of turns if the circular coil consists of n number of turns this equation becomes as mu naught n i by 2 r b is equal to mu naught n i by 2r so children this is the expression for the magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil having some current i from that equation what you have to say the magnetic induction is directly proportional to the number of turns and current the magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil is directly proportional to the number of turns and amount of the current and inversely proportional to the radius if the radius increases magnetic induction is decreases so this is the information about the children magnetic induction at the center of the circular coil while it is carrying current i so i hope you understand if you can understand this one like share comment the video and subscribe my channel if you can satisfied with my explanation my request is please suggest my channel to your friends also this is the crucial time to get the subject okay thank you for watching